block, delivering a screaming 650 horsepower and 650 foot-pounds of torque. For purists, there is the 7-speed manual with rev matching, but for the upcoming model year, it gets some competition. Yeah, a couple big changes for 15. So number one is the new 8-speed paddle shift automatic. So uh, 8 speeds versus 6, it's got better fuel economy, quicker shifts, um, better 0-60 to 60 times, so that's great for performance. For the record, this vet can reach 60 in a little more than 3.5 seconds. Todd Christensen lives and breathes this car. And at a meeting of the Greater Atlanta Automotive Media Association, he was more than willing to show off its features. But this one has the new performance data recorder in it. The recorder creates a video and data file of how the car handles under track or street conditions with results that can be analyzed using Cosworth Toolbox software. The PDR also has a setting for those times when you have to turn the keys over to other drivers, like valet parking. It, it actually locks the radio screen so you can't lower it to get to your valuables. It locks the uh, glove compartment, but it also then you can set record so when the valet drives the car to its space, it records all that. And when he comes back and gives you the keys, you can replay it back on your screen and just see if any foul play happened. With access to what is arguably a domestic supercar, why wouldn't a valet or anyone else want to take it for a spin? This is Greg Morris. We want to know what you think, so email us. The address is bumper to bumper TV at cs.com.